Hello, hello. How are we doing? Welcome. Hopefully everything is working and everything is well. Oh, my microphone could be up a bit. Okay, so I'm turning that up all the way. I got it just by the mixer now. And then hopefully, hopefully, um, everything sounds good. Let me let me switch switch over to this thing while I, while I figure all all this shite out. Okay, uh, so we'll switch over to this. Uh, OBS, please. Okay, I thought OBS. OB there we go. Welcome to the game called The Scarlet Crypt Press Hotel. I don't know what to expect from this, but oh, that's the fancy man, Dad. That's great. Hello. Is that what I wanted to do? Hi. Can I? Okay, I can move. That's an interesting concept of how I could just talk. Okay, the game... The game was freaking out. Enter the graveyard. Here lies Patrick Fattery. May his last breath echo in your ears forevermore. Here lies a rain drink... Rain... Rain... Rain drinker. Let his pixels go back to the stars they came from. Here lies Sir Sebastian Skaney. May this game live forever than he did. Longer than he did. Okay. Can I... Oh. Clicking on that actually brought up his Twitter. That's interesting. <laughs> Uh, what, what does Rain Drinker do? Rain Drinker literally also brings up Rain, Rain Drinker's Twitter. Fantastic! Okay, how about- This is literally bringing up all their Twitters. Thanks, fam. Can I interact with any of these? I don't know. Is this supposed to be like, who is this man? I could be that man. Do I say dad to you? <laughs> I don't know what to do. Because the only things I can go to is the hotel and the graveyard. Okay, so use the arrow keys to move your character. Press T and type your message to chat. And press enter to send it. Press E to grab it on another player. I think this is meant to be a multiplayer game. Let me do research. Hold up. It's an online multiplayer and requires a stable internet connect. This is a multiplayer game. Yup, that's what I thought. Well. Ten out of ten, best game. <laughs> God. You could briefly, you could sort of tell the title of the game, Fog of Life. Only if Jetpack will get out of the way. Let's look at the tutorial. Welcome to Fog of Life. Use the WS key to move around. Press M to open up your map. Go to the ruins by aligning the compass on the bottom to the compass on the map. Interesting. So north is the house. The ruins is like northeast, which is that way. And then you got my camp, which is the camp that is east. So the ruins should be like this way. I don't like that breathing. There's a, there's a wall. That's a, that's a, that's that's a fancy wall right there. I need to go northeast, and you're not allowing me to go northeast. Wait, Ex excuse me, game. You have required you have acquired me to go northeast. Look at my compass. I am northeast, and there is no ruins. I feel very debated right now. Oh, what is that? I don't like that. That wasn't too hard, was it? There's a note in here. Pick it up and read what it says. You can open your last picked up note by pressing N. Are we playing Slendy Man? Where's the note? Oh, it's right there. Go to the house. It's to the west. Align your compass accordingly. So you want me to go to status. I'm fine for now. Okay, so I need to go to the house. So the house should be, yeah, pretty much west. Hello, and about a home? Certain locations take a while to get to. Try your hardest not to de de devise your path. Okay. Oh, I can. Can I get. Allow me to get. Yeah. Yeah, boy. There should be a shotgun. M shotgun ammo somewhere. Explore. Once you find it, press E to pick it up. Um. Okay, found it. You can check your inventory. Cool. That's cool, fam. Once you're done with your press escape to go to the menu. Oh, wait. Really? Really? Ah, uh, f 
fine, fine. That actually wasn't the game. That was all the dictatorial. Ooh. At least now I know how to play the game. So I need to. This is different. Right here. Then the ruins should be north. I hit the railroad. I've gone too far. This is where it gets spoopy now. What's that? Ah! Oh! I. Wait. Oh, oh my god! Oh my. Oh, 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 no. 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 I'm cool. I'm. I'm. Dude, I'm like the coolest man you will ever see in your life, dude. I'm like so unbelievable. It's like so cool, man. You're, please, dude, no, no, e, e. They say no, dude, the, that the reason explosions. Oh God, dude, no, no. I'm G. Dude, dude, please, please, please. Dude, do you know? Do you know who I am? I am. I am. I, I'm. 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 I'm Nick. See me. Reapers after me. Where am I going? I don't even know. I'm just running north. Oh, this seems like this is going to be a problem. Oh, this seems like it's going to be a problem. I oh, no, we're good. <gasps> we're good, fam. Okay, I'm gonna like be 100% honest with you guys. Like the game is atmosphere is on point. I like Jesus, dude. The amount of times I've had a heart attack already. It's like outstanding. I'm hearing footsteps again. Oh my oh, God! Where? 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 Where are you? Where? There you are. Okay, can I lose you when I go over the railway? Or do you just follow me regardless? Okay, you follow me regardless. Okay. Okay, lost Grimmy. Okay. They say that a reason explosion like noises were not fireworks. Apparently someone dropped a bomb on us. God, how much more mess, uh, messed up is our... Hey, shoddy. Oh, <gasps> what is that? What is that? What is that? Dude, I'm trying to, I'm trying to read a note. Oh God, do I have three? I have three people on me now. What is this? Okay. Hopefully we'll be fine now. So that's interesting. The fog thing your Bob didn't make noise. So, I'm probably going to die regardless. Uh, the fog showed up the day after the explosion and it doesn't seem like it's about to leave anytime soon. Our house used to be in a nice suburban area and now it's in the middle of nowhere. We don't have any map or compass and I doubt my brother will survive. If we're lucky enough, we might get a pass to the railroad and get to the village up north. If we're lucky, the gods save us all. Okay, the village. Okay, so... Dude, I can't do anything without someone chasing me. Let's try to get to the village. Oh my god! Oh. 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 I jumped so fucking hard that I cramped my neck in doing that. Oh god. Uh Ah. Uh, well, this is awkward. Oh my! That's great, fam. That's great. That's great. My neck is still so cramped up. Like, when it just popped up in front of me, like, my whole body just tensed up and just went... <coughs> and it just, it just killed this part of, the, part of the neck. Oh, God. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop the game here and move on to the next. The atmosphere for the game and all the sounds and everything that the game had 
was spot on. It was great. Love, I uh, loved it. For my experience, what it lacked, what the game really lacked in was direction, where to go, and the fact that this map is so big. Unneededly big, like I probably went into a portion of the map that that wasn't even worked on, but it, it allowed me to go there anyway. The last thing you want for the play to go to is to go down a ditch. To which I don't know how far that ditch was away from the landmarks because I didn't run into any other landmarks other than the ruin. And allowing me to go into the un unfinished parts of the map was just like, it takes you away from the landmarks that you gotta go to. Like, with how you, with the with the tutorial and how the borders were set up, that was perfect. Because it told you, you can't, you can't go further than here, turn around, go back, and then boom, my landmark was right there. Only if that same principle applied for the actual main game, I probably would have found like landmarks and all that easier. But hey, we move, we move. So the next game that Nosemen has in store for us is a game called Meaningless. Mini, mini, meaningless. Meaningless. That's the word. Meaningless. So level zero, find the exit. Why? Why does it sound like? Oh my god. How? I am a snake. Hello. So this is like a maze type of game. Gotcha. Oh, my, 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 what stunning skin you have there. Is this the next? Oh, no, apparently not. Okay. So I'm assuming the stairs might be like the way you go for the next level, give or take. I like this curve. Oh, there's nothing at this curve. Who's there? Hello. Is it me you're looking for? I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in I wonder if there's actually a monster I actually have to worry about. If there is a monster that I've actually got to worry about, then dude, I should be dead like 60 times over. Ooh. Ooh. Subtle. Very subtle. Ooh, my god, that was closer. For what I was saying for like, this is for like, going through all different types of floors, I kind of expected it to be a little bit shorter, because it was like floor zero. And if this is going to be like a multiple floor type of deal, then I'd assume that it was the, all the different floors were going to be a little bit closer than what they are right now. Oh my! <laughs> I hate you, man. There, there's there's some funky things going on with electricity. I I, I think someone needs to call a tech, uh, electrician to come and check out these lights because they they they, they keep flickering. Oh, uh, I, I like the light. I don't know about you guys, but I like the light. I, I want to go this way. I want to go this way. I, I, there's, there's like a lot of really amazing things that it's just, it's just happening over here, you know, fam. There's a lot, a lot of amazing things. It's like actual working power. There's a lot of actual working power here. Like, wow, look at all these lights. It's all good for you. Like. On second thoughts, actually going into the narrow hallway just sounds like, and just instantly sounds like a whole much better of an idea than actually going down into there. So good, in fact, that. I knew it. I am a man. I am a man. I am a man. Okay. Me. This this is definitely this is definitely where he hangs out. See, not even scary. What is this? Trash. Literal trash. Not even scary. Not even a single bit. Not a single bit. Oh my god! Uh, 
I can I can say he's back from vacation. Why is there a random ass elevator? Here? I dude, I don't I don't understand this. You know what? We're gonna create the ending here. You know what? We've done it. You ready? You ready? You ready? For the, ready? The 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 doors the doors are shutting. You ready? 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 And oh 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 right, right, up 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 up. Oh, wow, the door's closed. Wow, it's very dark in here. Woo, very spoopy. It's very spoopy. I'm, I wonder what's going to happen. I wonder what's going to happen next. Wow. The, the end. Dude, dude, wow. Wow. That was a fantastic game. That was... That was truly... That was truly... A fantastic game. But no, actually, that was that was actually legitimately a good game. I wonder because the game is called Meaningless. I wonder if it was actually no reason for me to play that game. Hence the name Meaningless. And then because you found the elevator at the end, it makes sense. All the dead ends got really annoying. I would have loved it more if it was just a big old giant maze. Because that at the end at the end of the day, that's what that game was. It was to be. A big maze but making like literally every turn a dead end that got frustrating after uh, like a while because it, it it just kept going to dead end to dead end and it's just like it's so annoying because then you have to walk all the way back and just try another door to, to another way another door and you gotta go through multiple doors to which all those doors could just be dead ends i would have loved it more if it was just open and that would have been more, that more, would be more intriguing. And I also liked the, the fact that there was like, like no background noise to the game whatsoever. It really added to the game of just being there and not knowing what's going to happen. I really, really did like that. Um, I think that this is where I'm going to call for the, call off the stream. It is like close enough to 1am for me. And yeah, I, I, I like, I like sleep. I do like sleep. So, um... Hey, we're doing a bit of a different stream. Hopefully, I can do a lot more of all of these, a lot more of these streams. It was pretty fun. If you guys have any game suggestions you guys want me to play, let let me know in my discords in the game suggestions tab. Just start listing games of you, what you guys want me to play. It can be from the game Jolt. It can be from Steam. It could be horror games. It could be other games. Who knows? Links to the games will be down in the description. Um. This is just in case it's going on YouTube. I doubt it, but you know. I shall catch you guys all. I can't. I really, I'm really not going to say I'll catch you guys all tomorrow for the next stream. Because fucking I didn't stream for like a week. So I'll catch you for whenever I decide to stream next. So <laughs> until then, take care guys. And peace. <laughs> I'm a living legend. You ain't heard yet. You not get the message. From the moment that I'm stepping in, I get a couple weapons. Yeah, I turn to a beast when I'm rapping. Hey! I'm a living legend. You ain't heard yet, you not get the message. From the moment that I'm stepping in, I get a couple weapons. Yeah, I turn to a beast when I'm rapping. You are now watching the legend, so sit back and let the show begin. The pro was saying, I was able to go and get me loaded. And I know a face, but suckers ain't.